Hey guys, Wells Knight here, bringing you another brand new episode of 15 Minute Builds. And in this episode, we are going to be building this little log cabin that you see right here. This was suggested by one of you in the comments on the beach house video. And I liked the idea, so I decided to go for it. Now you might be wondering, Wells Knight, why are there three of these houses already? Well, this one was actually originally built quite a long time ago, and I just never did a video on it. Because I didn't think I'd be able to get it done in time. So then I rebuilt it to make sure that I could still, you know, get it all figured out. And then I already recorded this episode once, and the footage got corrupted. So I'm going to build it now for a fourth time, because why not? Fourth time's a charm, right? So... <laughs> Oh, man. Now, I do have uh, new shaders, I should probably mention. I'm running CUDA version 5 now instead of Rudo Plays. Just giving it a try. Let me know what you think of the new shader. But I think I have probably done enough talking. So, guys, let's go ahead and get right to building. I'm going to put 15 minutes on the clock starting right now. So, when you start this out, the first thing you're going to want to do is start out with some spruce planks and go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So start out with a 7 by 11 rectangle, just like that. Then we're going to take oak stairs, and we're going to go out 3 and over 3. And then here, we're going to go over 1 like that. Then on this side, we're going to leave a gap of three right here. And we're basically just going to mirror that like so. So we'll have a shape that looks like this when we're done. Now right here, we're going to put down oak stairs like that. And we're going to fill in this whole section with oak wood planks. Now this is a build, I should mention, this is a build that is pretty time consuming. So hopefully we'll be able to get the whole thing done, especially since I've had a couple of uh, practice runs, shall we say. But it's not quite as detailed as it could be, but then again, none of the builds in this series are as detailed as they could be, because that is not the point of this series. The goal of this series is to come out with fairly simple builds that you can kind of get some ideas from and then make your own and turn into something way cooler than what's possible in 15 minutes. So here what we're going to do is we're going to go up four with spruce planks and then over two, just like that. And then we're going to form kind of a framework around this whole section of the house, just like this. There we go. Now here we're going to go up an additional three, like so. And we'll bring that one over as well. And we're going to do the same over here. So we're going to have a framework on the house that looks something like this. Okay. Now we'll go ahead and fill in the walls with spruce planks. We'll go back and uh, do the windows and all that kind of stuff later. For now, we're just going to fill it all in with spruce planks. And I'm trying to speed build, but sometimes... When you're speed building, mistakes happen. So trying to build quickly, but also accurately. And that's the tricky part about this series. I've had a lot of people tell me that I should tackle certain, you know, I've, I've had a lot of suggestions for builds for this series that I loved the idea of, but I was just, you know, there's no way that we could do this in 15 minutes. You know, for example, build a castle. Well, I love castles just as much as the next guy. But there's just no way that I'm going to be able to build a castle in 15 minutes. Not a good one, anyway. Not even close to a proper one. Maybe a tower. Maybe a single tower on a castle. But anything beyond that is just not happening. All right. So when you get inside, you're going to fill in the walls like this. And we're going to leave a gap right here above one block above the door. Because right here, this is going to get filled in with oak planks just like the floor down there because you guessed it this is going to be the floor for a second level so we'll do that and then lining it up with the door we'll just put a hole right here and this will be we'll have a ladder that comes up here to the to the uh, second story 
Once again, not as detailed as it could be. We could do all sorts of cool stuff with like stairs and whatnot, but there's just no way that we'd be able to get it done in the time that we have. So here we're going to go three. And then here we'll go another one. And let's see, how does that look? Is this okay? Yeah. Right here, we'll put another plank so it will line up with these two. And then here we're going to go upside down stairs. One, two, three, just like that. So that's what this little balcony will look like. And now we can get started on the roof. And the roof is the tricky bit. We're going to knock out spaces right here, just on the other side of each of the deck. And that is where the windows for the second floor are going to go. Right here, right above the window, we're going to take this first layer of cobblestone steps and kind of bring them out just a hair. Then we'll put an upside down step there and an upside down step there and there, nope, not there, there as well. On top of that, we'll put cobblestone blocks and then cobblestone steps. And from there, it's just building it up in a nice even line, just like this. And then right here, we're going to put two cobblestone blocks just like that. So nice and simple. This side is even easier. We're just going to take cobblestone stairs and bring them all the way across like this. Very, very easy. Now, the slightly trickier bit. So, starting here, we'll take our spruce wood planks and we're going to form a triangle just like this. We'll do the same on this side. And this is kind of forming the outline or the guideline for where the roof is going to go. And for that, we're going to use dark oak stairs and bring them up like this. See how that looks? And then right, oh, I'm sorry. Dark oak stairs go there. And then on top of that, or dark oak planks go there. And then on top of that, we go dark oak stairs. And then we just kind of bring this over and around and connect this up as best we can. But we're going to stop right here lining it up with this block. So let's do the same thing on this side. Planks, stairs on top of that. And come on, there we go. And the roof is probably the most time consuming part of this build, I would say. There we go. So we'll have a shape that looks like this. Now this side is a lot easier. We're just going to take the dark oak uh, stairs and do something like this that will go all the way across the build. Come on now, work with me. There we go. And we'll get our roof all nice and filled in. What are we at? Seven, ooh, seven minutes already. Time flies, guys. Time flies when you're speed building. All right. So here we're going to take cobblestone slabs. Right here we're going to build it up one layer. And then here... Ooh, no, I'm falling. I don't want to be falling right now. Come on. And then here we'll just bring a layer of cobblestone slabs across the top like that. We'll put a cobblestone block and a cobblestone block. And then lining up with these stairs, we're going to put cobblestone stairs just like this. So we're going to have kind of a cobblestone outline underneath all those cobblestone stairs. We're going to put in upside down ones. And then in the middle one, we'll put a block of cobblestone as well. Steam. Uh, there we go. Then we'll just repeat that same thing on this side. So upside down, down here. There we go. So that looks pretty good. We got the roof done. Almost anyway. Now here, it gets a little bit more tricky. So right here, we're going to form kind of a... Oh, why am I using oak? I don't want to be using oak. Spruce. Here we go. So right here, we're going to do spruce, and then we're going to put spruce wood stairs like that. So it looks something like this. 
Okay, and we're going to have a window that'll go up there. Now it's time for a little bit of detail work. We don't need the cobblestone anymore. So let's grab ourselves some spruce fences. We will also need ladders and torches. And we don't really need the dark oak either anymore. So let's grab some light gray stained glass. The spruce fences are going to go just like this. And then right here, we'll bring them up. And then on top, right here, we're just going to form like a little balcony. Now it's time to do the windows. So some of these windows we can just kind of fill in without too much problem. Like so. Some of them are going to be a little bit trickier. So it's easiest to come inside. We'll have a window of two here. Right here, we'll have a window of one and one, one and one. We can put our ladder in right there. We'll put a torch here and a torch here. We'll go windows of two like that. And we'll come up to the second floor, windows of two. Here, I'm thinking we'll put a window of four and a window there. Window of four and there. And then we'll put a torch here and here for some lighting. Maybe another one right there. And I think that should do nicely. Now, to add a little bit of extra detail to that, we're going to put stairs. And we can probably go ahead and... Actually, let's just fill in all the windows right now to get that over and done with. Easier to probably place them this way. There we go. Got it, got it. Speed building. What a stressful thing it can be if you're not used to it. There we go. Please tell me I can get out here. Beautiful. Okay. Now, as I was saying, stairs for those windows. We'll go window, 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 window. Up here. Stairs. Inverted stairs. On this side, we're just going to do the stairs underneath. And same for this window right here. Oh, I missed a window. Let's fix that. There we go. And we'll put our stairs in here as well. What are we at? 1130. Oh, man, the time is going. All right. Got it. Stairs. Almost done with this part. There we go. And then I think here we'll put a stair underneath, and here we'll put a stair underneath. And that looks good to me. Let's go ahead and put doors on here. So we'll go spruce door there. Climb, 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 climb. There we go, spruce door there. Uh, this needs a little bit of touching up, I think. So we'll go spruce planks like that. Looking good. Up here, we'll put a torch right there in that corner and right there in that corner for a little bit of light. We'll also do the same here and there. And then we get to do some detail work, and this is going to be world's fastest detail work. So, bone meal, uh, coarse dirt. Let's grab maybe an oak sapling. And let's see what we can get done in the time that we have left. So let's bone meal all around the house like this. There we go. Looking good. We're going to knock out some spots here for a path. Which we will fill in with coarse dirt. Just so it looks like there is some sort of like pathway that leads up to the house. We'll maybe plant a tree there for a little oak tree. Maybe another one right over here. There we go. Ooh, that is the world's ugliest oak tree. Let's get rid of that. Oh, that's not a good... That's not good. That's going to slow me down a little bit. There we go. Let's try again. There, that's better. Okay, so we got about a minute and a half left. Let's do a little bit of work up here. So what we'll do is we're going to go real simple... We'll take some dark oak slabs, and we're going to cover up this little chunk of the roof so it doesn't look so obvious. 
And then here, we're going to put in so, ooh, do I want them there? No, I don't. I don't. I want them here instead, I think. And we'll do the same right here. That way, we've got a little bit of a depth change once you hit the elevation change. Looking good there. Um, let's also fill those in a little bit. And we got 45 seconds. 45 seconds. What can we do in 45 seconds? Um, do 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 Maybe we can bone meal a little bit more of this stuff. Change some of these. Maybe even another tree. Maybe like a birch tree right about here, I'm thinking. There we go. That looks pretty good. So we got ourselves a little log cabin in the woods. And I'm going to call this one done at 14 minutes and 48 seconds. So guys. There we have it, a nice little log cabin. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did enjoy this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave me a comment. I do appreciate it. It really, really helps out my channel. You can also find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Twitch. There are links in the video description below, so check that out as well. If you have ideas for a build that you'd like to see me tackle, put those in the comments below. I do appreciate your suggestions, and if I like them, I might just do them. But other than that, guys, thanks for watching. And I'll definitely see you next time. There wasn't enough depth, uh, and I just couldn't get it to look the way that I like, so I, was, I decided to do this. We're basically going to have a two-wide wall, and 